Yeah, bringing it up to the current decade. Let's bring it up to 2020. <laughs> it's what do people like to say now? It's 2024, people. Uh, Collider, from Collider, Smile 2 is so terrifying. It made the star Lucas Gage sick to his stomach on set. Does this news work for you or do you think this is just uh, a work or do you think it might i be don't true? know i feel like it might be a little bit of marketing yeah you think so <laughs> yeah i mean i you know you see things like this about movies all the time and then you get really excited and you're like standing hey. ovation by, yeah. the, by the producers right exactly <laughs> <laughs> i mean i mean smile one was incredible and i can definitely see it making people sick to their stomachs yeah some people but but the people who are there, right? Who know where like, the, the, the where what the made you sick to your stomach? The 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 costumes, yeah. Like, just the director, he's his ugly ass, or my co-star wasn't that hot or something. I don't know. What do you think? That's <laughs> no. Like what? Like, yeah, I guess that begs the question: What made him spe specifically sick to his stomach? Like plot twist: They catered lunch that day, and everybody got food poisoning. He probably, like, spoiled. <laughs> I hope he didn't spoil it. And this one was like, oh, it was when my character died at the end. Like, right. this, like he spoils it. Or something. Yeah. <laughs> Hopefully, he doesn't do that. So let's let me dive into it real fast. Okay, from Collider, it says, Smile Two will be in theaters this fall. But even before that, the film promises to be scarier than the first film. Uh, according to star Lucas Gage, in a, in a conversation with The Hollywood Reporter, Gage clarified his earlier comments when he said that shooting some scenes for the upcoming film made him vomit off camera, saying that while he didn't actually vomit, the reaction was close. In an earlier appearance on the Just Cage show, uh, Gage revealed that the filming had already wrapped which is also when he teased his reaction to some scenes in the film. If he, he went off by saying, if you love the first movie, you're going to love this one. It's so terrifying. It's the first time I've ever been on set where I was genuinely afraid and I actually got sick to my stomach. I hmm. didn't puke. I dry heaved. I was really shocked how intense it is on uh, the day. You just think, oh, it's acting. It's going to be fine. But that movie is so... I was about to, it even, the word isn't even there, but I was about to throw the F word in there. It's so effing scary. Yeah. The whole crew was terrified. The smile itself is just creepy. And then you throw the most gory scene on top of it. I just... Yeah, I have a weak stomach too. I'm a wimp. Okay, well then that clarifies it. He's just a pussy. Yeah. I mean, he was really he was really selling it for a minute. I was like, damn, but that thing, he's like, I have a weak stomach. I'm a wimp. I'm like, oh. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, he saw, yeah. How do we know that you didn't get the same reaction from watching Forrest Gump? I mean, <laughs> like, but, I mean, but so you think you're sticking with that market? It's just marketing. Probably. So, nothing to see here, people. He's just a pussy. No. <laughs> I don't know. But, or, or, maybe, maybe it could, maybe it could be. I don't know. I don't know. What do we know about Smile 2? The sequel uh, is the surprise hit Smile has not revealed many details about what uh, the film is about. But going with the first film's premise, one can expect some creepy smiles. Well, no shit. <laughs> <laughs> the first film starred uh, Sosie Bacon as a therapist who witnesses the bizarre suicide uh, of a patient. She goes through increasingly bizarre experiences, leading her to believe she is experiencing something supernatural. The sequel features an all new story and a cast led by Naomi Scott. Other cast members including Gage, uh, Raul Castro, Kyle uh, Gallner, Ooh, nice. uh, uh, Rose, Rosemary DeWitt, and uh, Dylan Dylan uh, uh, Galula, Galula, and Miles Gutierrez Riley. It is written and directed by Parker Finn, who was also behind the first film. So, cool. there we go. All right. So, no real details there. Just do with the weak stomach saying, I don't like that. You know, yeah, so basically. That's basically that's, that was, that's basically it. But still excited for it, though. You, uh, what did you, what did you, overall was your your thoughts when you when you first saw the marketing for the first movie? Did I you, loved the marketing. I loved. I thought it was so creepy. And if I was just like at the baseball game or wherever, they oh, had yeah, the, those people, that. I would be. And I didn't actually know what it was happening. I would be so creeped out. The people paid to just smile. At yeah. The camera. Like, oh, like, or like random people like just like in the audience amongst normal people just just doing that yeah yeah and i remember like the viral pictures of the woman who was like looking at like and, you were, <laughs> <laughs> i remember like that woman is standing sitting too close to that that minor like what the fuck is going <laughs> yeah. on over there? 
I yeah, the the marketing of it was good. I'm wondering if they're gonna they are gonna do something similar. Yeah, I can't or? remember what it is, but they think they've already started. Like what? I can't remember. I should have looked it up. But well, damn it, why'd you bring it up? Okay, next time. <laughs> <laughs> but I could only I can only imagine like like I guess oh what if they have like people in other movies uh, like I'm going to go see Ghostbusters, but this woman just sitting next to me doing. <laughs> Oh right! <laughs> like you like picky, like piggybacking off of other movies. Yeah, uh, I went to go see Deadpool, and this chick is just next to me, smiling like a freak. Right. <laughs> but I think that's what they should do if they can do it legally. Right. I don't know. They probably get sued for that. Mm-hmm. I don't know, but yeah, I, I I wanted to believe it when uh, but like when we started reading through the whole premise of it, it was like okay, this could just be some marketing. Yeah. But at the same time, I mean, well. I mean that's that's part of the uh, the thing. Uh, part, uh, actors uh, they're not only paid; they got to promote. So yeah, I really I'll I'll semi buy it because maybe he does have a weak stomach, and maybe and maybe the scenes that he saw did give him that reaction. But if it would have been like a producer saying this or the director saying this, I'm like ah, 